Tonight, the family of Rebecca Wingo, a young mother of two killed in the theater, talking for the first time about her legacy of love. 7 News reporter Jacqueline Allen found out Rebecca was known for her adventurous spirit, Jacqueline. Her mother says she lived life with abandon. That's why she was here at the movie theater that night. She always said yes, whether it was for an adventure or volunteering to help someone. She would have done anything for her two daughters, now left without a mother. We're just so sad. To, we just, we miss her so much. A mother in mourning. She says Rebecca Wingo was at the midnight premiere that night because she lived life to its fullest. She didn't just be happy. She was striving to be happy. Rebecca had served as an Air Force translator, was going to school, working at a medical facility to make ends meet. But to those who knew her, she was so much more. She was always volunteering. To, if, if you said, I need, then she'd say, okay, what? A devoted mother to two girls, nine and five. Rebecca had hosted five foreign exchange students, given money to friends in need, and always sat on the front row at church. That's how her family and friends want to remember her. Smiling ear to ear with that beautiful big smile, tears in her eyes, dancing at the end. She was just that person. She just lived life really well. We're certain that she's fine. We just want her to help us, help us, and mostly just to not miss her so much. And the family has started a college fund for Wingo's two daughters. They're also have a fun, having a fund for travel expenses for family members coming here for the funeral, which is Friday. Reporting live, Jacqueline Allen, 7 News. Thank you, Jacqueline. A fund to help the families of the victims now at $2 million. And we've also learned that United Airlines is helping families who need to fly in for funerals or to see loved ones in the hospital. United is working with the Red Cross and says it's doing what it can to help.